Let's see how it deals with this. So there are boom gates, and we're about to learn whether it detects the boom gates and stops appropriately. Very slow, too slow. Although the speed sign up here is 10, which feels painfully slow. We're not actually in that zone yet, we're at 40. Uh, there is nobody around, which is a great time to test, so I am just gonna let this roll. And if Tesla wants to get really fancy, if they were to detect a booth like this, well, you need to put your window down, assuming it's not pouring a rain, but they've got rain AI for that. They would put the driver window down for you, and I have a problem. We've pulled up, oh, no, I don't have a problem. Okay, that one's fully auto. My problem was going to be I wasn't close enough to push the button, but actually it detected the car and opened the gate. So you get a certain amount of free parking in here, I think is the deal. So we don't actually need a ticket and it would scan our number plate and bill us if we, bill us if we did, I think. Now this is an interesting move. I expected us to take us around there, around the, the drop-off point. And so now it's got a nav thing. I might actually end that trip. All right, so we are heading out of the car park now. And the signs say way out, but I think it's not, it's not turning these corners because of the signs and, and reading those. I think it's using the nav for that. And so that is secured parking in there. And we've got a second route out of here. Fortunately, there's nobody around, but it is way slower than it needs to be. Come on, go. And so we'll go around here to the right, and we've only been in here a couple of minutes, so in theory, the boom gates will open and let us out automatically because it's detecting our number plane. Quite a very -ish sharp right turn here, which it does it very well. Yeah, again, boom gate. Not really a visualization on it, but you can see the camera ahead, which is detecting our number plate. We are very far away from that. Uh, the display on the right. Thankfully, we don't need to. <laughs> we don't need to interact with it. But if we did, you'd need to the car to be closer to that. So yeah, it said no payment required on the screen and let us out.